Yo guys, welcome back to another video. Now today, I'm sort of doing something new on the channel. Still on Force Rise of 3 related on the second account of that. But I'm going to go to the auction house and see if we can find an auction house hero. Now, an auction house hero is an auction house build. Maybe we're going for a drift build. And if it is really good, like what we expect to be really good at drifting, it will become an auction house hero. It's a little series I want to carry on. Well, not carry on because I've started it. But it's a little series I want to start, which I reckon will be good. And if, if it's not good, say if it's awful at drifting, or it could just be my skills. But yeah, if it's awful at drifting, we'll just call it an auction house fail. Yeah, that makes sense. So if it's really good, it's an auction house hero. If it's bad, it's an auction house fail. So let's go on to the auction house and look for a drift car. Okay, so let's go to the auction house and we're going to go with a drift car. So... For drift cars, I don't like it any quicker than S1, so S1, there we go, and it can, uh, I, won't, I don't like drifting all wheel drive, I really, really prefer rear wheel drive, so if we go to advanced. One eternity later. Okay, so I've seen this Nissan S15, now it is S1868, which is quite, quite good, and it is maxed by out 131,000, so... I'm actually going to buy it out because there's no, there's only a three grand difference from the bid to the buyout, so we might as well. That's if we could get it. Bam! Yes, we have got it now. If we collect the car, we can go and see if it's any good. Okay, so judging by this so far, it does seem okay. It's got a cool uh, livery on it. Shout out to this livery maker. Ah. But yeah, it's looking good so far. It's got a roll cage in the front, which. I don't know, I'm not a huge fan of the Forza roll cages to be honest. But to put a roll cage in it, I, I actually would do it. Just don't really do that. I mean, it's got a pretty cool boost cage in it. I like that. So, we're going to take it for a little drift run. I don't have any good drift sections unlocked, I don't think. Like, I, I, why not? Why do I not have these drift sections? I've got like this one here, but it's off-road, so doesn't really count. But I've got nothing, so... This is like a drift section here, so we'll go for that. We'll see if it is any good at drifting. Then we might take on the off-road drift section. Traction control, off, stability control, off. Yep, that's all good. Don't need to change anything else. So hopefully it's good at drifting. Oh, we've got the first corner coming up here. Nice hairpin. Oh, I've taken that wrong. That's not gone well. Okay, so. I'm, I'm going to leave that corner out. We're not going to count that. Off we go up here. There's a ute in the way. Why would you stop in the middle of the road? Yep, there you go. Not bad, not bad. That's not bad there. And again, round here, round here, yep. Yep, yep. It's doing alright, it's doing alright. I'm just bad at drifting, really. Yep, I am rubbish at drifting. I'm gonna go for a little fire and base section now. That oh, section's always quite good, I like this. There you go. First of all, I didn't start off well, but I'll improve, don't worry. See, we're doing better, we're doing better. Ah, no. I've, I've failed it there. I have failed it. Oh, there you go, there you go, there you go. Too far, too far, too far. Nice to regain it. It seems good about that car. You don't always lose control, which is nice. I've got some nice uh, little, like, hairpins up here. We take a turn on oh, there. So you can just let it to slide. That's what I like about it. You can let this car slide. You don't always lose control of it. So it, it seems like it's doing all right. Got to realize I am an inexperienced Forza Horizon 3 drifter. Or, well, I, I would say experienced for the amount of drifting after you're done. I'm just not good at it. Right, here we go. We've got a corner here. Some nice corners, actually. Yeah, it's good. This is good. It's a good drift car. Whoa, just skimming the drive tile right there. Just skimming it. Hitting that mini though. Gonna take it around here, take it around there. Ah, I've almost lost control, but I haven't. I've regained it. You don't accelerate, you do actually regain control of this, which is good. That's what I'm liking about it. The blue design is also working on the car as well. It's very bright. Which is good. Yep, yep, yep. 
taking that well, taking that well. Get very close to the Fiesta there. That was actually really close. Didn't expect to get that close to it. But it did. Well, no, not bad. Got a nice corner here to take. Very nice corner here. And then into another corner. Taking that well, taking that well. Very wide there. It's, it's, it's a nice car to drift this. Really is. Oh, it's. I'm not. I'm not going up there. I'm turning. I am turning. Around the bin. Oh, we just skimmed the bin and we just smashed them bins. Yeah, you could really swing this wide, like I've already said. This is so good. You don't usually get really good drift car off the auction house. You really don't, because people tune it to how they like it, not how you like it, obviously. But I'm liking this so far. It really is nice to drift. Right, here we go. Last little section in Byron Bay. Then we'll take it up to a drifty mountain road if we can find one. Which we should be able to do very nicely. Cutting that a bit there. Getting close to the fence and the bins. It's all good. Drifted it nicely around there. Like so. While I've not failed. Just going to go around here. Clip it aside. Ease off a little bit. Back up the gas. There you go. That was good. That was a nice section. Now let's go find a cool road to drift. That was a road here on the left. Which could be a good drift road. I'm not too sure but looking by the map it looks all right so here we go first person for a little few corners because i like first person drifting it's quite good that second corner wasn't that good though right there you go there you go there you go little tap just a tap just a tap muck that one up completely we just destroyed everything. There you go, that one was nice. Oh, 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 almost. Just completely twitched the other way then. Yeah, this this road's alright to drift. Gonna go into a bit of third person now though. Oh, there's like a traffic jam right here. Oh, so many cars. I'm liking this little road though. Oh, I didn't see him, didn't see him at all. Yes. There you go. I've hit that Mitsubishi. Entering the new road into a drift. Oh, thought I could have held onto that bit longer. Oh, we got a corner here. He's in the way. Oh, no. He's in the way. We're going to keep going. We are going to keep going. Yes, 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 yeah. Never mind, we'll forget that just happened. We'll continue and then we'll bring this video to an end. Because we've done a fair bit of drifting. Just a tap yet again. There's a nice corner coming up. A long sweeping corner, it looks like. There's some cars. That's okay. This is the second bit. This is the second bit here. Yes. 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 Oh, I didn't really turn out to be a drift, really. Oh, smashed into the X5. Smashed into the X5 and into a tree. That sums up the video, really. So, in the hands of an actual good drifter, this S15 would really be good on Forza Horizon 3. Honestly, this is definitely a very good drift car. And whoever tuned it, you did an awesome job. Okay, so I'm actually going to change the name. You know how I said it was Hero or Failure? I'm going to change it to Hero or Nah, because I say like, or Nah sometimes in videos, so I'm going to go with Hero for being good and Nah if it's not, so this is a Hero drift car, because it is a good drift car, it really is, I do like it, the design is amazing, everything about this S15 is really good actually, I just love everything, like, it's not like even got a bad design, like every single bit, and damn off, see, um, a good drifter would have kept that going, but oh, how have I kept control? I haven't. But yeah, thank you very much for watching the first episode of Hero or Nah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. I'm gonna be doing more of this. Subscribe if you're around here. But until next time, guys. Peace out. But I already know I'ma get it now though. I'ma get it now though. I'm not slowing down though. Coming for that crown.